While it's still early in the wildfire season for much of North America, we already have seen some very large wildfires in parts of Texas and Oklahoma and a fairly large number of Canadian wildfires that started in 2023 are still burning. In this short video, I will summarize the wildfire outlook for North America for the months of May and June of 2024. While this video focuses on North America, some of the information may be applicable to other parts of the Northern Hemisphere, particularly Siberia. The map on the left, which is from the Predictive Services Branch of the United States Interagency Wildfire Coordination Center, shows the expected wildfire potential for all of North America for the month of May 2024 while the map on the right shows more detailed predictions for May for the United States alone. Note that the predictions in the map on the right are a bit different than for the same region in the map on the left. The reason for this is that the map on the right includes predictions based on input from local agencies as well as the national agency. From the map on the left, we can see that large areas of Western and Central Canada are predicted to have above normal risk for wildfires during May of 2024. Temperatures in this region have been significantly above normal. Much of the region also has been abnormally dry or actually experiencing drought conditions. 55 of the wildfires currently burning in Canada started back in 2023. We also see from the map on the left that a large portion of mainland Mexico currently has an above average probability for wildfires during the month of May of 2024. This is a consequence of severe drought conditions in a large portion of the country of Mexico. Heavy precipitation across the continental United States and Alaska during the winter and spring of 2024 is the reason that the potential for wildfires in the United States will be normal or even below normal for most of the country during the month of May 2024. Only portions of Arizona, New Mexico, Florida, and extreme southwestern Texas are expected to have above normal risk for wildfires during May. There is a difference between the two maps for wildfire potential in Hawaii during May, with the more detailed map on the right showing a higher than normal uh, potential for wildfires in Hawaii during May. These maps are for the month of June of 2024. Keep in mind that meteorological summer starts on June 1st and that wildfire danger increases as the weather gets warmer. This means that the normal potential for wildfires is higher in June than in May. Again, we see that a large portion of Western and Central Canada is expected to have above normal risk for wildfires during June of 2024. Also during June of 2024, much of mainland Mexico will continue to see above normal potential for wildfires as drought conditions are expected to continue in this region. Because of the heavy precipitation earlier in the year, much of California will continue to have below normal potential for wildfires during June of 2024. As the detailed map on the right shows, in addition to the above average potential for wildfires in portions of Texas, New Mexico, and Arizona, much of Florida, all of Hawaii, and a portion of the upper Midwest is expected to experience above average potential for wildfires in June of 2024. Thanks for watching. I hope that you have found this video informative. If you have any questions, please post them in the comments section and I will do my best to respond.